So, we are here actually uh, for uh, a good reason and uh, for myself, I love the web. I am doing the web uh, since, uh, yeah, should be standing here and I should be using that, yeah. Hey, I love the web, so it's not easy because I can't see my slides, so I don't want to, something like that, yeah. Uh, and that's true, I am developing on the web since forever. Uh, I started probably 18 years ago. Uh, and I immediately love the fact that I can write once and deploy everywhere for, for, for real. It, it literally works everywhere. I am driving at Microsoft the Babylon JS uh, 3D engine. We, we use it uh, for 3D, wow, uh, for a lot of Microsoft assets. And it's also used as a open source project by many games and uh, application out there. Um, and that's what I love, actually. I create a tool. And this tool is used for people. I don't know how to build a house, but I know how to build a pretty robust hammer. And I love that. And I guess we can all relate on that idea that the web is probably the best thing that humanity came with. So uh, we are here to improve that. <coughs> 15 years ago, Flash Games. I loved that period of time. It was very fun. Um, Flash died. Uh, and we replaced it by the web. And I think it was a good thing. Sorry, Adobe. But I think it's good to be only open. Uh, and now we came with very more advanced stuff. The web today is pretty powerful on the web. Uh, uh, recently, I was able to play Minecraft, which is probably my favorite game, on the web. Like the entire Minecraft stuff, where I, I spent ages playing with, it's entirely available on the web. If you go on classic.minecraft.com, it's going to be Minecraft only on your browser. So we did wonders. We did wonders, but unfortunately, I love the web, but in the same time, it drove me crazy. Like, we have so many limitations yet. And I have friends, I have game developers that use different um, languages like Unity, Unreal, whatever. And I'm a bit jealous. I'm a bit jealous. Yes, they can't reach the same amount of people as me, but they have tools, <laughs> they have toys. And as a developer, I am jealous. I want more toys. And I guess that's, <laughs> yeah, that's them calling, like, uh, yeah. <laughs> You can be jealous. Um, so we're going to cover uh, many topics uh, that we have in our agenda. Um, among them, they're going to be assets management. It's a problem. We know that on the web when you share your IP. Like five years ago, I worked with uh, Ubisoft on Assassin's Creed Pirate for the web. So it's, the entire, it's not the entire game. It's, the, it's some kind of a mini games. They were pretty scared by the fact that people can easily get the content. And that's an issue when you deal with a game. People can spend ages writing and creating the assets, and, then, and they may not be interested to share them. So that's something we need to discuss. Asset management, by the way, it's also about size of downloads. Like uh, the web is everywhere, and the web is uh, even on places where network is not that good. And so we also need to think about that. Performance, obviously. So I am writing a 3D engine, so performance is the core of my business. And I need more tools for that. And I'm going to actually present something later on about that. Uh, we're going to also talk about, obviously, cloud support. That's where the industry is also going to. And so we need to uh, make sure that the web stays relevant in that space. So it's going to be about IP protection. It's going to be about file size. It's going to be about compression. It's going to be about a lot of stuff like web GPU. Yay, I love this one. Uh, threading. Yes, I'm going to be the champion of this one as well. Uh, Web assembly stuff, it's going to be about new codecs, it's going to be about gamepad support, etc., etc. We're going to have a lot of really interesting stuff. And I just want to say, let's change the web together because that's the best tools, uh, the best tool we have, even more better than what it could, what it have been. And it will be better than that. I know that. We are all here with that in mind. So, and I'm pretty impressed, to be honest. We have a lot of people from different organizations. Most of the time, we call us competitors. We are not competitors today. We all work against the same enemy, I would say. So we are all friends today. That's cool. Thank you very much.